The Buddha said we should know both the Dhamma and the Atta, A-T-T-H-A, its purpose. And in some cases we know the purpose because we read about it, we hear that it's for the sake of the end of suffering, for release, for freedom. But to really know the Atta, you've got to find it inside. The Dhamma is there for you to use. The teachings that the Buddha gave, the teachings of the Ajahns, all good teachings are meant to be used as tools. So we use them right here, right now, whatever is appropriate. This is why we develop mindfulness. Not so that we can hold everything in the mind all at once, but at least we have a good sorting system whereby when a particular problem comes up, we can remember, oh, I had this problem before. That worked the last time. Or that didn't work the last time. If it didn't work the last time, try to find something new. But try to have your experience, your knowledge that you've gained from the practice at your fingertips. This requires that you pay a lot of attention to what you're doing. And you get pretty single-minded. There are a lot of things that we can know about in the world that are really not worth knowing. And it just clutters up the mind and distracts us. So you're trying to simplify things as much as you can. So you can use the Dharma for its genuine purpose and not get waylaid. After all, the Buddha taught for a purpose. When he hesitated at the beginning of his career, wondering whether it would be worth it or not, the hesitation came from the question, well, would it accomplish anything? Would it just be useless effort on his part? But then when he saw that there would be people who would benefit, that's when he decided to teach. So it's for our benefit that the teachings are there. Learn how to use them well. You learn how to use them for their intended purpose. So you can know the atta inside, and not just hear about it, but have the actual reality inside yourself. So learn how to use the teachings wisely. And you'll find that they actually deliver the benefit that the Buddha promised. <laughs>